anything that can give my skin a bit of extra hydration, a bit of extra moisture, I will take gladly with both hands. <laughs> Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm sharing my current autumn morning skincare routine. This skincare routine is mostly made up of the Glow Pop products. I love their products, I have their products. I've noticed that it's getting colder outside. My skin has a tendency to be dry and dull and gray and there's really only one product that comes to mind whenever my skin is starting to look a certain way and that is the Glow Pop because their products are just so glowy, so hydrating and they make me feel very healthy and awake and like I've just been on holiday. I will have my other glow pot videos linked down below in case you want to find out a bit more about the glow pots. Anyway guys, before I keep you here any longer, let's jump right into the video. So let's get in. The first product that I'm using in my autumn morning skincare routine is the Fresh Rose Deep Hydration Facial Toner. I have a video about this toner, one of my previous toners. One of my previous videos, I mentioned this toner and I talked about what is in it and all of that good stuff. Kind of looks like a tea color. And um, if you guys did not know, I am currently on a skincare ban, so I'm not buying any more skincare really until what I have finishes. So my usual fresh, rose floral toner has finished so instead of me rebuying that like i would normally do i've just been using this toner instead and um you know it does the job i like it it's enjoyable i can recommend it i do find it hydrating however i think i just prefer the floral toner just because it's a lot lighter on my face and it feels a bit more hydrating and it penetrates a lot deeper into my face but i explain all of that stuff in my previous video about this toner so make sure you check that out if you want to find out more about this toner but even still in the winter spring actually all year round whenever you finish cleansing your face I do recommend going in with a toner just because it helps to just set your face and it means that the products that come in afterwards can just sink a bit deeper for me I love to use a hydrating toner because my face gets so 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 dry so anything that can give my skin a bit of extra hydration a bit of extra moisture I will take gladly with both hands <laughs> and then next i've got serum so this is a glow pot autumn skincare routine so next i've got the glow pot ace serum and this is really hydrating i love this this has a nice combination of vitamin a c and e so this will help with brightening your skin hydrating your skin evening your skin tone and just helping with all round skin fabulousness i'm a huge fan of the glow pot as i I say every time I use their products. I just like to dab that on, run that down the neck. I have loved this serum since the first time I used it and it just gets better with time. This is so nice. It's so hydrating. You can see even from here, I'm quite away from the camera, but you can see even from here how like glowy I look. My skin just, you know, feels moisturized. It's popping. Love that smooth that out this is super hydrating if you've got dry skin this is alice dry skin approved i enjoy this a lot i really like it and i love the glow that it gives it leaves you with a nice a nice hydrating healthy looking glow that you almost look like you've been on holiday and who doesn't love that don't know okay guys then next we have moisturizer this is another glow pot product i have the glow pot ace moisturizer this is going to help with your anti-aging needs similar to the serum this is packed with vitamin a c and e so this is very moisturizing it's hydrating it's helping with your fine lines your wrinkles those early signs of aging which we love i've also loved this moisturizer since the first time i've used it and it just again it gets better with each time one thing i've noticed about this ace moisturizer is it really helps with my breakouts it helps to tame my breakouts it just helps to tame my skin in general which i really like and i've noticed that whenever i don't use this moisturizer my face the breakouts that we get is just it's not the one so i really do love this moisturizer it's a nice multi-purpose all-in-one kind of product and it is surprisingly hydrating like it's not something that i would have thought it would be look at the glow it's the glow for me i just i love to look glowy and dewy i feel like when my skin isn't moisturized and isn't glowy and dewy i just look gray i look a bit like death basically so i love products that do just hydrate my skin and you can see the glow a mile away you're literally like an arm's length away from me and you can still see all of the glow going on which low-key i'm obsessed with 
absolutely love that. Okay guys, wow, it has only been six minutes. I am zooming fast today, but I think it's because it's 1 p.m. and I'm just, can't believe that. I've not done my skincare yet. Anyway guys, I'm gonna go and get dressed and when I come back, we're gonna continue on with my autumn morning skincare routine. Okay guys, so I'm back. I'm only wearing my dressing gown because I'm coming up a bit weird on camera. So I think it's the white on white is not, my camera's not agreeing with that. Okay guys, so I'm back, I'm dressed. So cozy, so warm. You know that winter is here when you are lusting for a knit jumper. I love this knit jumper. Anyway, so now we're gonna do sunscreen. To be honest, I was actually gonna try this Ryman P20 sunscreen, but then I was just thinking, because I've not used this before, and I would rather do a whole separate video just dedicated to this sunscreen once I've been using it for at least a week. So I think we're gonna not do this sunscreen today. So keep an eye out on my channel for future videos. This Ryman P20 sunscreen comes recommended from a couple of you guys who I trust and love all of your opinion so really excited to try this out so i guess in the spirit of the glow pot and the glow pot autumn skincare routine that this video is named after i am instead going to be using my glow pot moisturizing spf 30 sunscreen this is uva uvb protection pa plus 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 and i have a video on the sunscreen to make sure you check that out if you want more information on the sunscreen they do say that you need like a 50p size amount but you can't like continuously like squirt out in a strong like it just so that's my only thing anyway just gonna dab that on the sunscreen is a bit thick and it can be a bit stiff to apply, but it goes on really nicely and it doesn't clog your face. Reapplication is amazing. Like when you reapply in a couple hours time, it doesn't feel like you've just like loaded it on your face and it gives you a nice glow. And again, because this is the glow pot, you already know that the glow that this thing is gonna give you is already really good. So this does give a lovely glow, nice healthy glow, and you just kind of feel like you're ready to take on the world. Okay, guys, so that is that. Oh, yes, before we finish, I'm gonna put on some lip balm. Just gonna put on some lip balm. This is the Fresh Sugar Lip Treatment SPF 15. I love this lip balm, it's so good. Oh, it's a bit hard though. Nice. We still need SPF even in the winter time. Okay, guys, so I am now finished. Skincare is done. I am looking and feeling glowy as ever and I absolutely love it. Hope you guys enjoyed my autumn morning skincare routine. These are the products that I am currently using, but my skincare routine is really changing every couple of days, if 